more distance and time you put between you and the fallout particles, the better. Today I'm going to be painting in the wild again. And this is about as wilderness as I get. I'm not a big let's go into nature for fun type. I don't like camping or hiking or surfing or skiing or mountain biking or going to the beach or you name it. Most of the time, if your sentence starts with, hey, wanna go? The answer is no. But I love nature. I like being in nature. I like getting insight from nature, learning her secrets. It's healthy to be in nature. It's good for you. It's good for your mind and your body and your soul to go into nature. I like the feeling of her all around me. I like the feeling that I'm part of nature, a part of this continuous cycle air conditioning, carpet floors, AOL Instant Messenger, iTunes gift cards, a Moog synthesizer, Kraft macaroni and cheese, a Lego Darth Vader alarm clock, and books on mid 20th century French philosophers don't separate me from this cycle. I brought my headphones because I normally like to listen to something while I paint. And I took my headphones out of my backpack and I said out loud to the tree in front of me, nah, nah, nah. And I put them back in my pack. This is my first time going out into nature to paint in many months. And this is my first time ever trying to record it. There were a lot of bugs. Bugs are a reminder that you're constantly dying. There were bugs, and the lid on my coffee thermos wasn't tight enough, so hot coffee was seeping out and down my, the side of my shirt while I was hiking to this spot. I'd basically call this not the best watercolor plain air painting I've ever done, but not the worst painting in the world. And I will show up and do it again. Douse myself in chemicals, bug killing chemicals, maybe practice some trees in the backyard, watch a James Gurney video of him painting in the woods and see if I can derive any insight from that and look at paintings by Egon Schiele and Gustav Klimt and see if they have anything to offer too. And I'll find a new spot in nature, probably not very far out, but here in nature and try again.
passing on unconfirmed information and rumors. If you come in contact with the infected, seek medical attention.